Last week we had Jujutsu Kaisen from last score staying at the top until the release of The Way of the House Husband, which went right to the top of the list. Many of the anime that ranked high were from the last score. Let's see how the new spring anime were doing last week. So on Monday, The Way of the House Husband kept its top position, followed by Jujutsu Kaisen and Horimiya, which were both doing well last week. That time I was reincarnated as a slime, which is another winter anime still is at 6th place, taking all the positions. My Hero Academia and My Hero Academia and Shaman King are the only two anime that started this spring. Kono to Tomare Sounds of Life is at 10th. Like I said last week, it's probably because those two seasons were released last weekend. By the way, it says April the 12th, which is Monday. However, this top 10 is from what was watched on Sunday. April the 13th still has The Way of the House Husband at the top. Tokyo Revengers is a manga by Wakui Ken, well known for his manga Shinjuku Swan. The story centers around Hanagaki Takemichi, who obtained the ability to go back in time and tries to change the fate of his first love who gets killed by Tokyo Manjikai in the present time. My Hero Academia also moved up a position, Jujutsu Kaisen falls back to 5th place, and Horimiya and that time I recarded it as a slime is still in the top 10. April 14th, Tokyo Revenger is still at 3rd place, and yes, the way of the house husband is still at the top. My Hero Academia drops back a bit, and Horimiya is still in the top 10. April the 15th, again a new anime, The Slime Diaries, ranks at 5th place. The anime itself started in April the 6th, but the Netflix streaming is a week late, so that's why it started coming up. My Hero Academia is still holding up its position. The Seven Deadly Sins is currently in its fourth season. It started in January, but the season is still continuing in its second core. Shaman King gets back in the top Top 10 with its new episode being released the next day. April 16, The Way of the House Husband is still at the top, Slime Diaries is doing well at third place, Jujutsu Kaisen still at fourth, Seven Deadly Sins, Tokyo Avengers, Orimiya still in the top 10, and at the 10th place is The Saint's Magic Power is Omnipotent, which is another new anime that started in April with the Netflix streaming a week late. Shaman King had its release on the April 15th, which should be reflected on the 16th, but probably because it was released at night, it couldn't boost its viewing to get into the top 10. April the 17th, still with the way of the house has been at the top. The Seven Deadly Sins moves up to third place, which is probably because it had a new episode released. The Slime Diaries at fourth. Jujutsu Kaisen follows. And my favorite, Godzilla, singular point, ranks at seventh place. I hope it gets more views because currently this is the best anime in April, in my opinion. Shaman King makes it at 8th place with its new episode. I thought they would be more popular, but, but I guess the readers of the manga are getting maybe a little too old to watch anime. And finally, April the 18th, The Way of the House Husband is at 3rd place, followed by Jujutsu Kaisen, The Slime Diaries, and Shaman King moves up to 6th place. And at 8th place is The Seven Deadly Sins. And as usual, I scored the animes that made it in the top 10. First place 10 points, second place 9 points, and on and on. Here are the top 5 anime of last week. The Way of the House Husband is of course at the top with an astonishing 68 points. Coming in second, Jujutsu Kaisen at 50 points, which is still amazing since it's not a spring anime. And third was Slime Diaries. 4th My Hero Academia, and 5th Horimiya. I see that two new spring anime made it in the top 5. I hope the other anime will do well. The Way of the House Husband is probably at the top because it released all episodes at once, so thinking maybe next week some new, the one of these two new anime might move up a few more and I don't know how long everybody's gonna keep watching Jesus Kai saying yes it is fun but anyway let's wait and see what's going to happen next week. Thank you for watching Otaku News Talk. Please leave a comment telling us what kind of news you would like to hear. Also don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel for more news straight from Japan.